every natural law has its spiritual counterpart. Thoughts are seeds, which falling in the soil of the mind germinate and develop until they reach the completed stage, blossoming into deeds, good or bad, brilliant or stupid, according to their nature, and ending as seeds of thought to be again sown in other minds. A teacher is a sower of seed, a spiritual agriculturist, while he who teaches himself is the wise farmer of his own mental plot. The growth of a thought is as the growth of a plant. The seed must be sown seasonably, and time is required for its full development into the plant of knowledge and the flower of wisdom. The seen is the mirror of the unseen.